What's going on guys? Welcome back to Car Extreme Racing. Today we're going to be taking a look at another brand new 90 Adhesion Street tune, this time for the Mark IV Toyota Supra. Now the name of the game with this car is smoothness, so if you guys are into those slow slick tandems, this is the car for you. You guys know the drill. First we're going to hop into some driving clips, talk a little about the car, how I tuned it, and how I like to drive it, then I'm going to give you guys a tune so you can try it out for yourself. As always guys, if you do enjoy the tune or the video, feel free to leave a like down below, subscribe for more Car Extreme content just like this, and I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Alright guys, so here we are on the 90 Adhesion Mark IV, and as I mentioned in the intro, this car is all about smoothness. This car transitions a lot slower than say my S13 or even some of my other Mark IV tunes. This makes the car perfect for seasoned drivers who are looking to smooth out their line a little bit, but also for beginners who are maybe not so comfortable with their transitions. I'd say it handles closest to my M4 or my E36 tunes, insert BMW and Toyota joke here, and it'll go around a little bit easier for you if you're into 360s. Let's head over to the tune. Alright guys, so starting off with our tune, we got body kit and wheels. We're running body kit number 5, it's actually the same one we had on our VDS Supra, and for wheels we have TE37s, they're second to last in the RC category. Heading into the dyno stand, guys, we got our spring lengths at 18 and 15, stiffness at 90 and 80, fast bump at 21, 80 and 26, 90, fast rebound at 68, 80 and 71, 90, damper bump at 37, 70 and 3,500, and damper rebound at 13, 140 and 10, 600. Front toe at 0.99, rear at negative 0.1, cambers at negative 7.31 and negative 1.29, no roll bars on this car, 10 caster, 23 Ackerman, and max steering angle as always. For wheels, we got 19s with 265s, 110 for a tire pressure both ways, 90 wheel adhesion as well, 4 track, 3 base, and 30 tire profile. Engine, we got our tune at 5, max torque at 5160, rev limiter all the way up, turbocharger yes, but air pressure at 1.2 for 756 horsepower. And I'm gonna check, I'm gonna check for you guys because I do this some, I did it once, yep, stock engine, so we're good. <laughs> Transmission, we got a diff at 0.85, final drive at 3.25, gear 1 at 4.2, gear 2 at 2.2, gear 3 at 1.8, gear 4 at 1.6, gear 5 at 1.47, and gear 6 at 1.42. For brakes, we got a torque at 1330, bias at 75%, no ABS, no launch control, and we are running that ultimate setup as always. So guys, if you do enjoy the tune or the video, feel free to leave a like down below, subscribe for more CarX content like this, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.